Okay, I think that's it. God damn it. Rafe and Nadine must have dozens of guys out here. I mean, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. <clears throat> Jesus, these pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now how do we get out of here? Again with the winch, Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. <clears throat> Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, all right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than rape? No, that's not how she operates. She's more of a money up front kind of mercenary. Look. Shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. Singing the same damn thing. What if they found the treasure already? Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah, well, you're right. Hey, Sam. You don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was just one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History? Hey, is that a well? Well, well, well. <laughs> Get it? You know, because it's a well. <gasps> Sully, you stole your joke. What have we here?
Did you find something down there? Baby, do me a favor, get behind the wheel for a sec. Will do. Hey, Sully, throw the car in reverse. So? Nothing major. I'll show you back at the hotel. Sorry, you were saying? Um, no. Right. <laughs> History? Uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. But you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. That's pretty much it. Ah, God. See that smoke? Shoreline, slow down. Sorry, you were saying? Um, oh, right. That's pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad and never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. Check it out, boys. What is it? Guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline marks? Can't tell. Well, it would appear we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Drawbridge? How medieval. Yeah. Well, you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to keep people out. Or protect something inside. <laughs> another sigil. So, do you recognize this one? I do, actually. Anne Bonny. Mm hmm? Operated out of the Caribbean. Thought she died in jail. At least that's what the stories tell us. <laughs> right. Avery must have invited her, too. Let me check out that drawbridge. 
Sounds good. Hey, be careful, kid. All right, I'll see if there's something up here. Hey, guys! There's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Bingo. Sam! Special delivery! Hey, kid! You all right? I'm fine! You all right? Yeah. You got this? Mm-hmm. I seen a few. I'll bring the car closer. You just relax. I got this. I mean, there's only one crank, you know. <laughs> Keep up the good work, kid. Try that again. There we go.
Big tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? a nitpick, but Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? <clears throat> well, it was worth a try. <clears throat> I got mud in my mouth. <clears throat> Take a look around. So just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh, half. Half of what? Well, he only knows about the Gunsway heist. Which is worth 400 million. <laughs> right, but if Nathan's theory is correct, then there's a lot more treasure. Well, you should have told him it was 200 million. You never tell your partners how much a job is really worth. I wasn't exactly expecting to be caught with All set. Here we go. Uh oh. Don't spin out now. Sharing this one with my shrink. <laughs> Wait, you have a shrink? No, but I will after this. Come on, you guys are overreacting. Get the whole thing under control. Hold on to something. Ah, ah that was a nice change of pace. Yeah, I'm almost disappointed. Yeah, almost. Now, let's find our way in. Let's go claim our treasure, boys. Sam, give me a hand with this. Yeah. Let's see what we got here. Huh. Looks like 
think there's something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. Damn. It's bricked over. All right, let's look around. Hey, careful with that thing, kid. Heads up! God, Jesus! I said heads up! He's got a lot riding on this. See a treasure, though. You guys, coming. Come check this out. Saint Dismas, we meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery. Thomas too. And that's, uh... Um... That's Adam Baldridge, that's uh, Joseph Farrell, and that's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so, uh... Let's see, what do you think the trick is here? Gotta push a button, pull something? Uh, maybe... Maybe one of the arms, or... Yeah, give it a shot. <coughs> Come on. Boys. <coughs> Whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, I think you might want to come take a look at this. Trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Hector, you're a goddamn genius. Hear that, Nate? Genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if we're here, this tower lines up with Avery's sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, a treasure's gotta be in one of them, right? <laughs> yeah, but which one? I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? Looks like we're not the first ones here.
That all of them? Well, let's hope so. You okay? Yeah, yeah, fine. Sam? Yeah, over here. Hey, what are you doing? He's confirming a suspicion. Shit. Look at this. They figured out the towers, too. Locations, sigils, the works. So now what? Now what? Now we're screwed. Okay, because there's three of us, and there's God knows how many of them, and they have a head start? Yeah, but they don't know which tower to go to yet. Well, that's great, Nathan, because neither do we. Yes, we do. <laughs> Look, it's a little worn down. Right there, that's a match. Yeah, are you sure? Because, I mean, it could be this one, too. Crap. Yeah, but still, two beats the hell out of 12. All right. I'm gonna take this tower. You and Sully, you take that one. No, 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 no. no, no Rafe's guys are all over these towers by now. Exactly. So if we want to have a chance to catch them, then we've got to split up. Uh, Sam, just hold up a second, will you? Nate, he's right. These towers are at opposite ends of King's Bay. If you run into any of those shoreline clowns, you call us, okay? See you soon. Come on, Nate. We gotta hurry. Yeah. All right, there's our tower. You really think all that treasure's gonna be just sitting in the middle of a goddamn market? Oh yeah, that'd be crazy. But we've seen crazy before. That we have. <laughs>